Good morning, students. Let's take a look at our spelling lesson for today. So we're going to be reviewing compound words. Before we go ahead and look at the words here, or maybe go ahead and look in the words and think, see if you can remember, what is a compound word? What does a compound word have to have to make it a compound word? So hopefully you remember that compound words are just made of two actual words. If you take them apart, you have two separate words and you put them together to make one new word. So all we're going to do with these is the same thing we did yesterday. We're going to take a look at the word, try to write it out next to it. Then we're going to cover that up and then write it one more time. Okay, that'd be the best way to do this. Let's take a look at the first word. So we have sailboat, backpack notebook, handbag, keyboard, haystack, popcorn, thumbtack, hardware, and earthquake. All right, so if I were doing this copyright cover, I'm just looking at the word sailboat. I'm gonna go ahead and copy it. Now I'm gonna cover it up and think about first, how do I spell the word sail? Easy peasy, expected spelling pattern. How do I spell the word boat? Notice I'm not putting a space between the L and the B. Another expected spelling pattern for boat, and that's how you spell sailboat. Let's take a look at the directions for the bottom here. It says, these compound words broke during delivery. Match up the bits and pieces, then write the completed words in the boxes below. So what you're gonna try to do is match these words here with these words here. You're gonna put them together to make one word. So for example, let's say you only have three to do, so I'm not gonna do one of these for you. <laughs> but let's say that up here, I had the word quake, and over here, I had the word earth. Notice that if I've got this little end here, this would mean this is going to be the first word in it, right? Because it's ripped right here and you're going to put another piece there. Okay, so I would take earth and quake and put them together if there was a box down here for that. And I would write earthquake. So that's all you're going to do with these parts here. And I'll go ahead and read them for you. So we have tack, pack wear, back, hard, and thumb. So you wanna go ahead and take a look at them and just try to put them together. So I could say back tack, is that a word? Thumb wear, is that a word? So you might have to switch them around a little bit in order to get the word you're looking for. All right guys, have a great rest of your day.